To make our rice pudding we need a ovenproof dish. We want three tablespoons of short grain rice, one tablespoon of caster sugar, a knob of butter and either 50 ml or a pint of milk and nutmeg. Ideally if you have the whole nutmeg you can just grate over that's even better. So this is what we do. We just simply put three tablespoons of short grain rice into the dish. One tablespoon of caster sugar. Knob of butter. And then we're going to add in the milk. So 50 ml of milk. Sorry, 500 ml of milk. Won't be much good with 50 ml. 500 ml of milk. Or a pint. And then we're going to heat this in a preheated oven at 150 degrees. That only just about fits in there, so hopefully it'll just about work. It's a bit of a small dish, but it's the only one I've got. Whoops, sorry about me leaning across there. And then all we're going to do now is stir that all together. I think I might put this on a baking tray because I think otherwise we might end up with it all going absolutely everywhere. So we mix all that up together nicely. And then we've got our ground nutmeg. And I'm just going to put a pinch, which is just a little, a little bit of a sprinkling. You can see that. Hopefully just a bit of a sprinkling. And then we'll put that in the uh, preheated oven, 150 degrees. It doesn't really matter whether it's conventional or fan. 150 on either of those settings is allegedly fine. Uh, so as our oven proof dish is only a pint and it needs to be ideally a one and a half pint dish, uh, I've put it on a baking tray to stay, save any spillages. So now I'm going to pop that in the preheated oven 150 degrees, doesn't matter whether it's fan or conventional 150 degrees allegedly is fine and that'll go in for about uh, one and a half to two hours. I'd just check it after an hour and a half but probably it'll need the full two hours and after the first half an hour just give it a stir to stir in the uh, butter which will be melted by then and uh, then hopefully you'll get the lovely nutmeggy crust on the uh, on the top ready to come out of the oven that's now been on for about two hours but probably an hour and three quarters would be perfect <laughs> 